Oh, um, hey. I wasn't expecting to see you here. Oh, what am I doing? Well, I was actually planning on texting you. I have something really special I wanted to share with you, but I wanted to make sure it was the right moment and that I was prepared, so... This is kind of awkward. Oh? You wanted to see me? Really? <laughs> I... Excuse my, um, blushing. Well, I know that I've already confessed to you, but... This is... This is a little different, and... That's actually probably what you wanted me to... To talk about, huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh? So... You like me too? Really? That's amazing. Then this will be so much smoother than... I... I'm moving. Don't worry. It's not gonna be harmful to our relationship at all. Really? I... I wanted you to move in with me. It's not too far away and... We could start a life together. After all, it's about time. Don't you think? We've been friends for years. It's not like we have to go on these little dates and figure out stuff about each other. We already know each other so, so well. I love you. <laughs> What's that on, um... Your jacket. It's, um, glowing red. Are you okay? Is someone... Did someone bug you? Are you in trouble? Don't worry, I got it. See? It's simple to crush and deactivate. Huh? Why do you look so scared? I promise I won't let anyone harm you. After all, we're going to have our happily ever after. I don't want... Did you... Did you just flinch? <laughs> that bug, it wasn't... It wasn't to spy on me, was it? After all, why would you want to spy on me? Your best friend... Someone you can trust. Like, we just got together and we're going to move together. Why would you want to ruin that? Unless someone's harming you, but you look so scared. Wait, do you think I'm responsible for all those killings that happened at school? Baby... No, uh, I didn't kill them. Well, I mean, I may have had a little bit of involvement, but it wasn't technically me who killed them. You have to understand that. The people you were with, they were bad people. And bad people get bad punishments. After all... You saw what they wrote online about that girl. It's no wonder she snapped and did them in. Huh? <laughs> she said it was actually me that convinced her? No, no. I would never do that. I did tell her who wrote those rumors about her, but I never said for her to, you know... I may have implied that they needed to be stopped and, and that talking wouldn't do anything and there was only one possible way and to shut them up forever. But I told her not to do it. It's not my fault. 
You look so cute when you're scared, you know? Don't worry. I wouldn't do that to you. Unless you made me, but you wouldn't do that now, would you, darling? I'm not acting strange. You're the one who tried to plant a bug on me. You don't believe me, do you? Well, since someone got the police involved, I'm going to have to take um, a plan B to our little love affair. Oh, don't worry, puppy. You'll be okay. You'll be perfectly fine. As long as you play by my rules, we'll have a wonderful life together. And even if you don't play by my rules... I'm sure we could train you. <laughs> oh, don't worry. If you behave, we won't have to worry about it. Oh, <laughs> you're really cute, you know that? Saying, oh, I'm not going to go with you, as if you actually have a choice. I like that fiery spirit that you have. It always made me so attracted to you. I can't wait to break it. <laughs> Shh. Don't worry. Come on. You didn't think I came unprepared now, did you? Well, I was hoping that plan A would work and you'd accept my confession and you'd willingly go and live with me and we'd have our happily ever after, but plan B works too. I suppose before you pass out, I should explain to you what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm sure you'll like it. Well, I'm going to take you to our little home that we have together. It's under the radar, so no one will find us, but I think you'll like it. My friend actually owned it before us. <laughs> then, I'll have you in the basement just for a little bit until I can trust that you won't run off. That's where we'll do most of the training. If we need any training at all. I'm sure it'll be good. Then we'll actually be together. I'll let you roam around the house with the doors locked and the windows locked of course, but then once the Stockholm Syndrome finally hits and you become mine forever. We'll be happy together. Just like I imagined in plan A. I'm going to get what I want. No matter what. And don't worry. You'll also benefit from this. You'll have a happy, loving wife. That will do literally anything for you. Except let you go, of course. <laughs> Now that doesn't sound so bad now, does it? A loving, caring wife. One that would wake you up in the morning with a big breakfast and take care of all of your needs. Doesn't that sound perfect? Every person's dream is to be loved unconditionally. And that is the love I want to give to you. I love you. Oh, my sweet darling, it looks like you're going to pass out soon. I can't wait till you wake up, then we can start our life together. It might be a little bit longer than I wanted it to be until we can get our perfect life, but I'm sure that together we will be an unstoppable couple. Oh. You're so cute when you pass out. I love you. I'll see you at home.